Hi, everybody. Welcome back. Prepping today's eight-minute meal with UConn Culinary Operations Manager, Robert Landolfi. Thank you again yeah, so Robert. much for this is being great. This Happy is great. July 5th. You too. <laughs> so you're really switching it up here. Hot dogs, and then we see these carrots. We're switching this up. <laughs> we're, we're going the healthy version of the hot dog here. But what's amazing, it's going to taste like a hot dog. No. So, really? Oh, yeah. Wait till you, wait till you okay. get to the end. It's going to blow right. your mind. So what we're going to do is we're actually using regular carrots, okay? And what we're going to do is we're going to poach them in a liquid here. So I have some water in wow. this pan. And what we're going to do is we're going to add some soy sauce. Mm. We're going to add some rice vinegar. Okay. Sure you want to let all these secrets Apple out? Apple cider I mean, vinegar. Oh, yeah. yeah mm. I'll share. I'll share. A little sesame oil. So far, and then these what are we're things I do, have in my kitchen. That's and these, good. Are, these are actually yeah. some spices that are in hot dogs. Oh, really? Yeah, people don't realize it. Onion powder, garlic powder, a little bit of ginger, and some black pepper. Huh. Okay? I'm going to just stir that up. So more. hot dogs are pre-spiced? Is that what you're... What they're doing is they, they actually season oh. the meat before they fill the casings. Really? Exactly. Oh, and then what we're going to do is we're going to take the carrots and you okay. just cut off your ends. Right. And you just really quickly just peel them. Okay. It's both sides. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to add this right to our poaching liquid. Oh. Along with our other carrots. Okay. So it's going to smell like hot dogs. It's going to smell like hot dogs. It's going to taste mm. like hot dogs. Okay. And we're going to simmer this. It's going to take about, depending on the size of your carrots, about eight minutes. And you okay. just want to simmer them until you take a fork, and they're fork tender. Mm -hmm. Okay, you don't want them mushy, you don't want them hard. Okay. Okay, now, after you're done, you can actually take them right from this liquid, and you can actually put them in a bun and eat them. Or what I do is I actually put them on a little sheet pan, I put them in my fridge, I cool them down. And then when you're having a cookout, everyone comes over the house, you break them out, you know, you're doing your burgers and things, mm -hmm. and, you know, you just, you grill them, and I'm just grilling Definitely them right here in a switching it up with that. Exactly. And what people don't realize is, the f at first they're going to be like, no way, I'm not eating that yeah, carrot. That That's about? crazy. You know what I mean? <laughs> but, you know, you, you cook them up, you get them nice and tender, and then what you can do is, you're going to find, I'm going to build one right now. So you put that right in there, I'll yeah. let you build it. Okay. So these are all your toppings over here, yeah. okay? Yeah. So this right here, fun. this is a blend of ketchup and mustard with fried onions. Wow. Okay. That one all is right. actually, you could call it the onion crunch dog. Let me, let me paint a little bit of this on. Look at that. Okay. You're an artist. There we go. You're an yeah. artist. Yeah. And then you've got over here, this is actually the Chicago dog, which is right here. So you've got your mustard, your relish, pickles, jalapenos, tomatoes, onions. Mm. And this is a little bit of celery salt. I've got to say, you have really good toppings. Yeah, yeah. These are, exactly. And that's, you want big, bold this flavors. <laughs> this right here, the slaw dog. So what you have is you have your barbecue oh. sauce and your coleslaw. Nice. And, and really what it comes down to is... You know, if you, is that, is that usually, what do you usually like on your dogs? Are you a of, slaw dog kind of guy? Dog you know? guy? <laughs> Actually, I'm a um, just ketchup and mustard guy. You're simple. Right. You're simple. Look at me, I'm kind right, of so getting wild. It's all right. This is good. This is good. Basic. So what I want you to do is, when you, when you take a bite out of this, mm -hmm. shut your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> all right. And what do we think? Does it taste like a dog? Hutch, try this. Isn't it, it's crazy. Oh, going it's really on. It is. It's crazy. I can't even believe it. Oh, my gosh. It. And, and you'll notice the texture. I can't even believe it. It's, no the texture way. is I think I work like for the company dog. here. I swear to God. <laughs> We're going to market this. Not it's getting unbelievable. any <laughs> Really. And this, this right here, I'm doing them with carrots, okay, which right. is great because, again, another uh, four or five weeks, you're going to have some local carrots coming in. Right. This is a great option out at your cookouts. Wow. Um, you can do it, like I said earlier, with some parsnips if you want, if you have some of those in your, your fridge. Yeah. Because you know, a lot of times people think carrots, they think, oh, I'm going to put them in a salad or I'm going to roast no. them off. Yeah. Think, think out of the box. Yeah. You know what I mean? You know who would be impressed with this? April, who does our Meatless Mondays. That's there you right. Go. Yeah, tell yeah her that's about it. This. Better trademark this today. Yeah. yeah. And wow. what's, what's nice about these is this is actually a vegetable. So we're not making a, a, you know, a meat alternative and making it look like meat or taste like meat. No, it's this straight is up actually carrot. a nice carrot. Are college kids liquid. eating this? This is going to be on our menu. Regular oh. everyday menu item starting in September. Oh, wow. Freshman yep. orientation. Mm, here we go. <laughs> Fighting the freshman 15. We'll still have hot dogs. Though. I just want to All share right. that. We're yeah, not we'll going to 100%. A little carrots. break now in, in the busy times gearing up. A little break right now. This is a, we're actually testing recipes right now. That's how this came about. Um, we're looking at our menus, um, putting some great, you know, exciting new dishes on the menu. So Wonderful. when the kids come back, it's Thanks, fresh. Rob. Nice. Thank you so much You're for welcome. coming. Thank